everyone. I'm Stephanie Adenero and I'm from thefitrv.com. I'm also a silver sneakers instructor here in Salt Lake City and today I'm at Camping World of Salt Lake City inside this beautiful Jayco Eagle fifth wheel bringing you a hand weight workout. So are we ready to get to work? Let's go grab your dumbbells. We're gonna start seated with just some easy breezy bicep curls. Here we go. We're gonna go up for two and down just like that nice and slow three of them slow like this two more last one now let's take it fast here we go let's do eight seven make sure you're really lowering the weight slowly five your back is up nice and straight three two all right, that's your first set. Nice job. Let's get out of the car, or I guess out of the RV. So swing your leg up and over. Come up into a nice split stance. We're gonna go into a row. So you're gonna reach forward, and we're just gonna pull that weight like this, up and back. Now your body shouldn't be moving at all. So I'm holding myself nice and still, pulling my elbow back. It's like you're starting a lawnmower. Think of it like that. Let's do six more, five, four, three, two. All right, nice job, you guys. Let's go into a split squat, keeping your feet in that same split stance. We're going down and up. Now notice, I'm pushing through my front heel. My hips are just driving straight up and down. My heel's up on my back foot, down and up. Good posture with these. Let's do four more. Three, two, and last one. Awesome, you guys. Let's go into some tricep kickbacks. Drive that weight up on your side. Elbows back. Ready, go. 12 of them. 11. Now, make sure your elbow stays back. Nine. Notice how my elbow doesn't leave that spot behind me. Let's do six more. Five, four, three, two more, and last one. Awesome, you guys, let's get back in the car. Or I guess back in the RV. Now swing your legs up and over, and let's come up into that split stance again, and let's do that whole thing from the other side, starting with the rows. Ready, go, and down, up, and down. Let's do 10 more. Nine, eight, seven. Make sure you're not swinging your body. You're nice and solid. Four more. Three, two, and one. Awesome. Back to the split squat. Here we go. Down and up. Down, up, down, up. Make sure your hips are driving straight down. It's as if you were gonna set your knee down a single meal, but you don't go that low. We're just dropping our hips a little bit. And up. Four more. Three. Two. And last one. Okay. You know what's next. Triceps. Ready. Go. Let's do ten more. Nine. Eight. Keep that elbow back. Seven, six, how high can you get that weight behind you? Really squeeze through the tricep. Two, and last one, all right, good job. Now, get your feet nice and wide, facing forward. We're gonna keep one, one weight down at our side, bring the other one up, going into some leans, looks like this, down and up, down. There we go, down. Now, on these, we're working your obliques, part of your core. We're leaning from the hips, keeping your core tight. Let's do four more. Three, two, and one. Other side, ready, go. Down, and down, good job. Now, if this makes you dizzy, Try not to tip your head to the side. 
try to keep your head up nice and straight. Let's do four more, guys. Three, two, last one. Very good. Feet shoulder width apart. Good posture. We're going to go into some shoulder work. Lifting the weight out to the side. Here we go. Let's do two more. Keep your arm nice and straight. Last one. Other side, ready, here we go. Up, and down. Up, and down. Good job. Two more. Make sure your arm is not coming any higher than this. All right, let's change this to the front. Look at this, we're gonna go to the front now. Nice and slow. Four of them to the front. Nice and controlled when you lower it too. Don't let gravity lower it. You lower it. You're in control. Other arm. Here we go. Let's do three more. Two more. And last one. All right, good job. Let's go into some calf raises. That's just weights down at your side, lifting your heels, going up to your tippy toes. Let's do four. Three, two, now let's do two squats like this. Down, and up, again, down. Back to calf raises, here we go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, two squats. One more. Nice job, calf raises last time. Eight, seven, six, five, Four, three, two, and two squats. Awesome. Last one. All right, let's sit down. We're gonna do a little fly thing. So sit on the front part of your chair. As you lean back a little bit, you're gonna open up the weights and bring them closed. It's not a big movement. Leaning back and closing. Now, make sure your back is straight. You're leaning from the hip. Keep your core tight. Open and close. Open and close. Kind of like a little chest fly action here, but our arms are low. And close. One more. All right, now let's go into some nudges with one weight. Looks like this. You're gonna pull back and four, forward, back and straight. Good. Press, press, four, three, two, and one. All right, let's do the other arm. Same thing, get that motion going. Let's do four, three, two, and one. All right, good job. Let's stand back up. Press those weights into your thighs. Sit, stand up. Weights up at your shoulders. Feet are wide. To toes are pointed out. And we're going to lunge side to side like this. Twist and lunge. So your weight is shifting side to side. Your hand weights stay up at your shoulders. Two more, and last one. All right, great job. Let's sit back down. Try to do those bicep curls again. Let's do some nice slow lifts. Ready, here we go. Let's do four of them. Three. Two, how we doing? Last one, I know I'm warmed up. Let's do eight fast now, seven. Make sure you have excellent posture. Four more. Three, two, and one. All right, you guys, we're standing up. We're getting out of the car. Swing that leg up and over. Press your legs into that split stance. Let's repeat the rows, then the split squats, then the triceps. 
Ready, go. Let's do 10, nine. Really control that arm. Eight, seven, six. Nice and smooth. Four, three more. Two, and last one. All right, split squats. Ready, go. Down, up, down, up. It's really important we have good posture on these. Pushing through your front heel, back heel is raised. Four more. Three, two, and last one. All right, good job. Get that weight up on your side for tricep kickbacks. Ready, go. Kick the back and in. 11, 10, doing lots of these. Nine, eight, that's this underarm area where we get our flabby, hangy skin. We gotta fill it up with some muscle tissue. Four more. Three, two, and one. All right, you guys, get back in the car. BRB, I guess. <laughs> the Jayco Eagle. And swing your leg out. Let's get out of the car on the other side. Press yourself up. Let's do those three exercises again on this side. Ready, go. We're rowing. Kind of like starting your lawnmower. Awesome, you guys. Get that elbow back. You're squeezing your shoulder blade into your spine. Working your back muscles. Let's do three more. Two. And here's our last one. Split squats. Ready, go. Down. Down. Let's do eight more. Seven, six, five, four, three, two. All right, that's your last one. Woo, those are killers, aren't they? I love those. All right, triceps, get that elbow back. Ready, go. 12, 11, 10, Nine, really squeeze through your triceps. Seven, six, five more. Four, three, two, and last one. All right, good job guys. We're back to those oblique leans. Your feet are wide, leaning and raising. Looks like this. Join me, go. Let's do 10 and up, nine, Eight, seven, keep your core tight. Five more, four, three, two, and one. All right, other side. Ready, go. Down, up, down. I really feel these in my, my obliques, I love these. Great way to tighten up your core. Eight more, seven, Six, five, four more, three, two. All right, shoulder time. Weight down at your side. We're gonna lift and lower. Three more on this arm and lower. Two, make sure you have really good posture on these. Last one, other side, go. Up. And down. Up, take it slow and down. Two more. Down. Last one. Let's go to the front. So we're up and down. Up. When we switch to the front, we're changing the shoulder action a little bit. Up. And up. Good. Other arm. Go. So now we're working the front part of our shoulder when we lift to the front. Two more. Last one. Back to calf raises. Weights at your side. Up, up, up. Good job. 
Let's do four of them. Three, two, now squat. Down and up. One more. Down. Eight calf raises. Go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, squat. Here we go. Down. And up. One more. Down. Calf raises. Go. Eight. We're almost there. Four more. Three, two, two squats. Down. And up. One more. Down. All right, sitting down, guys. Back in the chair for a little more core work and some chest work. This one. Now, when you do these, make sure your feet stay in contact with the floor. If they're coming up off the floor, you're leaning back too far. Open those weights and close. Keep your core tight when you're leaning back. Four more and close. Three, close. Two, close. And last one. All right, we got those nudges. Remember the nudges? It looks like this. Nudge. So you're leaning back a little, twisting your shoulders, you nudge back. Four more. Three, two, last one. All right, good job. Other side, same thing. Ready, here we go. Now, I didn't mention breathing yet, but whenever you're working out, you wanna exhale with the effort. So where it feels hardest, that's where you exhale. Four more, three, two. All right, guys, one more exercise. We're so close to done. Press up, stand up. We're going into those sumo lunges. Ready, go. Twist and twist. Keep your feet planted, shifting your weight side to side. Twist and twist. Six more, five. Four, can you feel it? We're almost done. Three, it's such a good feeling. And last one, and I have good news for you. You are done with your workout. Well, you finished this segment at least. Grab some water, take a break, and then grab your resistance band for the second part of your workout. And remember guys, RVing is much, much better in a fit body. See you later.